camera, so it's a little difficult for me. Hi, Barb. Hi, Cam. And I'll go in and get the wool. We come here about once. Wow, I think five or six times a year we come and get I wool think now. So. Yeah, it's great. And uh, Barb um, has wonderful merino sheep. Maybe we'll get to meet them. Maybe not. So this is the meadow where the sheep spend their time. Right now they're sleeping in the barn because it's been raining all morning. We tried to get a picture of them in the barn, but it's dark in there and they're sleeping and I hate to bother them. But this is their meadow. And there's their neighbor horse, who I guess doesn't get to come on this side. Uh, I guess he's not as polite as the sheep. But here you get a look at where they spend their day, where they spend their life. Very pleasant. This is the Marhaven Yarn Shop. You can see some beautiful felted scarves and some felted hats that Barb and her um, fiber artist friends make. And then there's these beautiful yarns, which I always lust after when we come here, and I almost always buy something. Will I have time to make them into hats, which is my preferred mode of knitting? Maybe not right away, but certainly soon. And oh, here's the kitty that lives in the, in the Marhaven uh, shop. Um, I remember when she first came to live here, she would barely even let me near her, and now she's obviously much more comfortable. And so I'm going to pay for our wool and I will uh, begin the long journey home. We'll just give one more glance through. This is uh, Barb's wonderful organic yarn. We do use this organic yarn in our um, dust bunnies. Although I believe we use the thicker um, worsted weight. But uh, her wool is available online. I will uh, put the uh, URL for that, and I highly recommend her wools. I especially recommend these hand, these are gorgeous, Barb, are these Thank new you. colors? These are gorgeous. Uh-oh, I'm in trouble now. Talk later.